Hello, boys and girls. Today's book is called Volcanoes. This is a nonfiction book, so we will be reading it a little differently than our fiction stories. This book is by Anne Schreiber. Volcanoes by Anne Schreiber. Table of Contents. Mountains of Fire. Ash and steam pour out of the mountain. Hot melted rock rises up inside the mountain. Suddenly, a spray of glowing hot ash shoots out. It is an eruption. More melted rock is forced out. It spills down the side of the volcano in a burning hot river. Anything that cannot move is burned or buried. Word blast, eruption. When magma reaches Earth's surface, some eruptions are explosive. Hot rocks. When magma comes out of the earth, it is called lava. The lava hardens, ash and rock pile up. A volcano is born. Deep beneath the earth's surface, it is hot, hot enough to melt rock. When rock melts, it becomes a thick liquid called magma. Sometimes it puddles together in a magma chamber. Sometimes it finds cracks to travel through. If magma travels through a crack to the surface, the place it comes out is called a vent. Word blast, magma is a thick liquid melted rock. Magma chamber is a space deep underground filled with melted rock. And vent is any opening in Earth's surface where, vol where volcanic materials come out. Shaky plates, where do cracks and vents in the Earth come from? The land we live on is broken into pieces called plates. The plates fit Earth like a puzzle. They are always moving a few inches a year. When plates pull apart or smash together, watch out. This picture shows the gap that forms when plates pull apart. One place where Earth's place smashes together, plates smash together is called the Mid-Atlantic Ridge. It is the longest mountain range on Earth and most of it is underwater. An island is born. What happens when two plates pull apart? They make a giant crack in the Earth. Magma can rise up through these cracks. This even happens underwater. About 60 million years ago, an underwater volcano poured out so much lava, it made new land. A huge island grew right in the middle of the ocean. Lava formed the country of Iceland. About 50 years ago, people saw smoke coming out of the ocean near Iceland. A new island was being born right before their eyes. They called it Surtsey after the Norse god of fire. The ring of fire. What happens when plates bump into each other? Maybe a mountain will pu be pushed a little higher. Maybe a volcano will erupt. There may be an earthquake or a tsunami or both. The edge of the Pacific plate is grinding into the plates around it. The area is called the ring of fire. Many of er Earth's earthquakes and volcanoes happen in the ring of fire. Word blast, tsunami, large waves created by events like earthquakes and landslides. This is the ring of fire. Postcards from the ring. I lava you from Mount Merapi in Indonesia. Moose you very much from Kir Kirimsky volcano in Kamchatka. Washing you a great day from the Cascade Mountains in Washington State at Mount St. Helens. Having a hot time in the Andes. Tungurahua Volcano in Ecuador. Meet a volcano or three. Not all volcanoes are the same. What kind they are depends on how they erupt. The lava from a shield volcano is hot and liquid. Rivers of lava flow from the volcano's vents. These lava flows create a gently sloping volcano. Hot fact, Olympus Mons on Mars is a shield volcano. It is the largest volcano in our solar system. Seen from above, it is round like a shield. The Hawaiian myth of Pele tells, us, tells the story of how Pele, goddess of earth and fire, built a home on Mauna Loa. Violent volcanic eruptions are said to be Pele losing her temper. Meet Mauna Loa. This is Mauna Loa. A cone volcano has 
straight sides and tall, steep slopes. These volcanoes have beautiful eruptions. Hot ash and rocks shoot high into the air. Lava flows from the cone. One day, a cone volcano started erupting in a field in Mexico. It erupted for nine years. When it stopped, it was almost as high as the Empire, Star Empire State Building. Meet Perikutin. This is the Perikutin volcano. Hot fact, even though Perikutin stopped exploding in 1952, the ground around it is still hot. Scientists guessed that Perikutin spit out 10 trillion pounds of ash and rock. A stratovolcano is like a layer cake. First, lava shoots out and coats the mountain. Then come rock and ash. Then more lava. The mountain builds up with layers of lava, rock, and ash. Meet Mount Etna. There is a myth about Vulcan, a Roman god of fire and iron. He lived under Vulcan Island near Mount Etna. Every time Vulcan pounded his hammer, a volcano erupted. The word volcano comes from the name Vulcan. This is Mount Etna in Italy. The true story of Crater Lake. Crater Lake may seem like a regular lake, but it is actually a stratovolcano. It was once a mountain called Mount Mazama. Now it is a deep, clear lake in Oregon. An explosion over 6,000 years ago blew the top off Mount Mazama. Lava, dust, and ash swept down the mountain. The mountaintop fell in and a giant caldera was formed. Over time, the caldera, a crater, filled with water. It is the deepest lake in the United States. Word blast, caldera. A caldera is formed when the top of a volcano caves in. After the mountain collapsed, there, was, there were more eruptions. In one, a small cinder cone of ash and lava was formed. This cinder cone pokes out of the lake. It is called Wizard Island. This is Crater Lake. And this is Wizard Island. Volcanoes Rock. The name of this volcano is Pahoyhoy. How it is formed? It's fast, hot, liquid lava hardens into smooth, rope-like rock. It's special power. It hardens into beautiful and weird shapes known as lava sculptures. The name of this volcano is Aa. -A. How it forms? The crust on top of Aa -A lava hardens into sharp mounds of rocks. It's special power. It can cut right through the bottom of your shoes. Pele's hair. How it forms. Lava fountains throw lava into the air where small bits stretch out and form glass threads. It's special power. These strands of volcanic glass are super thin and long, just like hair. Small tear-shaped tear pieces of glass called Pele's tears sometimes form at the end of Pele's hair. Pumice. How it forms. In a big explosion, molten rock can get filled with gas from the volcano. When the lava hardens, the gas is trapped inside. Special power, the gas makes the rock so light it can float on water. Volcanic record breakers. Indonesia, a string of islands in the ring of fire, has more erupting volcanoes than anywhere else on earth. This is Java Island. The place with the most volcanic activity is not on earth. It is on Io, one of Jupiter's moons. In eight, the 1883 explosion of Krak Krakato was the loudest sound in recorded time. People heard the explosion over 2,500 miles away. Anak Krakato, which means child of Krakato, is a vo volcano that was born in 1927, where Krakato used to be. Mount Etna is the largest active volcano in Europe. Hot spots. Do you want to visit somewhere really hot? Check out these hot spots, places on Earth where magma finds its way through the Earth's crust. Hot spots are heated by volcanic activity. The Hawaiian Islands are all volcanic mountains. They start on the seafloor and poke out above the sea. Kilauea in Hawaii is still erupting. As long as it keeps erupting, the island of Hawaii keeps growing. On Kyushu Island in Japan, some people use the hot springs to boil their eggs. Take a bath with the monkeys in Japan. In Iceland, you can swim in pools heated by volcanoes. Exploding ending. If you visit Yellowstone National Park, you will be standing on one of the biggest supervolcanoes on Earth. 
Yellowstone sits on an ancient caldera. Magma still bubbles and boils a few miles below ground. Yellowstone has a lot of geysers, more than 300. The magma below Yellowstone caldera heats underground water. The water boils and bursts to the surface as geysers, spraying steam and hot water high into the air. Go to Yellowstone and see Earth in action. This, boys and girls, is called a picture glossary. And they have a picture, the word, and then what it means. A caldera is formed when the top of a volcano caves in. Magma is thick liquid melted rock. Magma chamber is a space deep underground filled with melted rock. A tsunami are large waves created by events like earthquakes and landslides. Eruption is when magma reaches Earth's surface. Some eruptions are explosive. Event is any opening on Earth's surface where volcanic materials come. Thank you for listening to today's stories, boys and girls.